Welcome back, everybody. She is an award-winning Indiana artist who was discovered by Design Scouts for the HGTV series Good Bones. How cool is this? And now she's a member of Indiana Own. We have artist Beth Cleary Schweer, along with, of course, Indiana Own's Mel McMahon. Thank you both so much for being here. Thanks for having us. Well, I walked in the studio this morning, and I thought, mm -hmm. wow, yeah. look at all of this. This is beautiful. Larger of course, life. part of an event coming up here in just a little bit, but I'm going to have you introduce our guest today. Yeah, yeah, I'm so excited to have Beth Clary Schwer yes. in Indiana Owned. Uh, we met quite some time ago now, but her shop is in Irvington, oh, uh, which cool. is where I grew up. She's right down, like two storefronts down from where my mom's shop yeah. was. And it's just amazing to see her artwork, hear her story. We had right. her on the podcast. Yeah, that and was fun. I am just obsessed with her artwork, and we love supporting <laughs> it her. It really as a is Aww, beautiful. Yeah, sweet. Thank you so much. Beautiful. Let's talk about. I mean, you were in the circus. I mean, that's a whole like side note, but that's no, super cool. I, when I was nine years old, I found out I didn't have to run away from home to be in the circus. It was right <laughs> in my backyard. Yeah. And, and it was the best thing that ever happened yeah. to me as a kid so in Miami County. That That's amazing. Yeah. How long have you been painting and doing art? Well, that was a later in life thing. I raised six children and wow. um, I had been an actress in a theater major at Ball State. Yeah. And when I was at home, I couldn't really do theater anymore. So I looked for a creative outlet and it led me to paint. Well, that's amazing. <laughs> yeah. hmm, I'm just going to take up something else. Why not? And right. look how good you are at this. Can you well, describe what we're seeing, how long this takes, what all goes into it? Well, I had the fortunate, um, I don't know what you call it. Yeah. I, I was able to study with a master Indiana Impressionist, C.W. Okay. Mundy. Okay. And he taught me uh, what how to paint yeah. and what makes a good painting. Yeah. And um, he also helped me develop my style, which is a little more expressive than his. Okay. And so um, it can be impressionistic, which means you have the impression that they're boats, mm -hmm. but it has a little bit more um, dynamic quality to it. I do love, the one thing I love about art is because it's so subjective and interpretive and what one person sees, another person may see something totally different, but it's what connects with you. Exactly. Yeah, exactly. I love that. And you have an event coming up, right? I know, Mel, it's, yeah. it's all about the roses yeah. here. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Everything's coming up roses and it's uh, uh, at my gallery first Friday in August. The yeah. show will open, or be up in my gallery starting next week. Next week, but the okay. opening reception is first Friday, August fifth, from five to ten. I'm gonna yeah. have live music. Um, I love being in Irvington, and there's lots of first Friday things yeah. going on lots in Irvington. It's a wonderful community to be a part of, and I'm so excited. Yeah. I'm between Giacomo's Pizza and. Uh, Black Acre Brewery. Awesome. You have so. to be so proud, especially mm -hmm. like with your area, but of yeah. course with what you're doing, having her as a member now. Mm -hmm. What has this relationship been like? Yeah. Well, what I love doing is figuring out ways to uniquely promote businesses. Yeah. Right? So working she is with so Beth. Good yeah. At it too. Yeah. I mean, just tell her a little <laughs> bit about what being an Indiana owned member means yeah. to you. Well, we got to know each other on your broadcast local matters. Mm -hmm. yeah. We got to know a lot about each other. And she really is so good at, at drawing out. Um, what makes each business yeah, owner shine unique, and special. yeah mm -hmm. and it's it's such a wonderful community and Indiana is such a wonderful place to be a small business yeah. owner. And, and I want to reiterate too, because we, we talked to you, Mel, quite a bit, but for other small business owners out there, what is that, that main thing that you're able to mm -hmm. offer them that perhaps yeah. they can't get other places? A lot of it is about access, yeah. right? Mm -hmm. Most people, when they're starting a business, don't know what resources are out there. Right. That's and true. so what we do is we help them figure out, okay, what is your message? What are you trying to promote? And then what partners mm -hmm. or what assets do yeah. we have? that can help you do that. Right, because mm -hmm. sometimes people can have the most fabulous business, mm -hmm. they just really don't know how to put it out there. Right. And of course, that's where you come in. Yeah. You guys were talking about your podcast earlier, mm -hmm. too. Yeah. Tell us about that. Yeah, Local Matters drops every Friday. We have a brand new episode, and we would love for you to just subscribe and listen to our podcast. Each week, we yeah. bring on a new member. We talk about how they got their business started, what they're doing now, and they give some amazing business mm -hmm. advice to I was going to say, if anything, sort of have a listening ear and take some notes because yes. I would imagine that with all of your guests, you can take something away Absolutely. and yeah. really learn something again. Yeah. So, well, that's that awesome. episode was a great 
example of that, <laughs> right. right? Our members are willing to share their stories. They're willing to tell you what worked and what yeah. didn't. And the more business owners that we can make successful, the better our communities. I think so too. Well, thank you guys both so thank much for joining so us. Much. This really is such a talent. Beautiful, mm -hmm. beautiful you. artwork. We'll put all your details about your event, of course, on our website, awesome. lifestylelive.tv. So good to see you, you too. as always.